science can sometimes get a little lost in the details. The average scientific experiment fails. The average project is pretty into the nitty gritty. It's not impossible for people to sort of lose the vision if it's not brought back to their attention. That's one of the tasks of the leader, is to say, you guys are doing great work. You just came up with this new observation about this new thing that nobody knew before. But let's step back a minute and say, why are we all here? What is this about? Science is this glorious adventure into the unknown, the opportunity to discover things that nobody knew before. And that's just an experience not to be missed. But it's also a motivated effort to try to help humankind. And maybe that is just by increasing knowledge, because that's a way to make us a nobler species. But maybe it's also to come up with something that will have a practical benefit. And for me as a physician, a lot of the motivation for science is that it ought to do something for human health. But we can get lost in the details and forget that that's what it's about. Certainly that's one of the roles a leader needs to play, especially if things are kind of not going very well. People are frustrated and the experiments haven't worked or the answer wasn't the one you wanted. Your hypothesis turned out to be wrong or, you know, your test tubes fell on the floor or whatever it is to sort of say, wait a minute, remember? We're really lucky here. We get to do this. We are engaged in a noble enterprise uh, to discover the truth. What an amazing experience to be able to spend your life that way, and especially to see how this might help somebody. That's part of what the leader has to do, remind you uh, when you're a little bit distracted by the infinite details that what you're really doing is something special, something that probably throughout the course of history, very few people have been given the privilege of doing.